Hey guys, Herman again in another Just My Review. As you guys remember, my uh, doorstep, the lighted version, it was replaced by the Honda dealer due to a malfunction and uh, some problems I got with uh, uh, one of the guys that make a, a hole and damage the piece and everything. Well, they replaced their time, the, the entire uh, doorstep uh, for a new one and uh, I didn't have any problems at all. Uh, the funny thing was uh, the uh, passenger side it wasn't replaced until this uh, week, past week, I uh, started getting problems with the lights. As you guys can see, this one got a nice light, but uh, the, the, the two lights basically were out and it looks like uh, on the models from the uh, 19 to the 20 or 17 to 20 something like that I can recall exactly you guys can you guys can check it out and see if your model is in this recall uh, Honda says that something wrong with this uh, uh, doorsteps and they basically uh, uh, advise the dealers to replace the piece and today they did it uh, I was removing basically the, uh, the brand new plastic that covers the doorstep but I, rem I I completely forgot about you guys and then at the moment I was on almost my halfway to removing this I said you know what let me make a short video to show these guys and as you guys can see this is a basically brand new piece that was basically left it on purpose for the owner to be removed and as you guys can see nice lights and everything brand new doorstep well it means probably it was a damaged piece and these guys they don't want to take any chances and they replace it uh thank you honda route 22 in hillside new jersey for this nice uh, step um i see you guys take care of the customers and it's a nice thing because you know why take chances for the future you know basically i got this on uh, if i'm not wrong it was on uh, may last year and these guys replaced the left side first because i start having problems then i got some problem with the first light these guys replaced this first light on the passenger side and finally they took the decision to replace this entire side the you know they probably don't want to take any uh, chances and they replace the whole thing well that's the update guys if you guys got this uh from uh from uh from the dealer it's already installed or it's not installed just make sure to check it if your model is uh probably in a recall from honda and if it is if it's on warranty under warranty take it to the dealer they're gonna take a look and they will replace it if it's needed uh it's a great job done by Honda. Okay, guys, this is another Just My Review. Thumbs up, subscribe if you are not subscribed and share. See you guys later. Before I finish the video, I just uh, was holding that video to uh, edit it and put it on YouTube. But, you know, um, fortunately, uh, I wait for two to three weeks after that video was made. And, you know, unfortunately, look what happened, guys. <laughs> yes how many lights we got here uh, exactly yeah we got just only one it means this is the brand new the brand new doorstep you guys just saw me removing the plastic yes this this one and it's around two to three weeks uh, later and you know i got one light out and guys honestly uh, i cannot blame the dealer i cannot blame uh the uh mechanics honestly because this is a defective light it looks like a this uh, part of light some of them are working fine and so some of them are working very very bad real real poor performance on these lights because the uh, driver side is still working very good they has got no problem with the other side it was installed last year and it's still working good but honestly i get tired of this uh you know, I don't know how many lights I already replaced so far. It's, it's, it's been a bunch and every time uh, you replace a light, it's $80. Uh, later on, guys, I'm gonna show you how you guys can get these same lights 
for $25. If you guys got this, the same design I got, these doorsteps, and you guys want to keep the original way. Well, guys, in my case, I just want to let you guys know, and this is just to keep you guys updated and make sure you guys stay tuned because I'm going to get a, uh, an aftermarket light. I don't have to make holes. I don't have to do anything. Actually, you guys will see it's kind of a crazy installation because I got these uh, paro lights online. I'm going to put the uh, description down below in the next video, not in this one. And I'm going to show you guys the parts I got. I got uh, connectors from Toyota. Yes, Toyota. And it looks uh, similar to the connector to uh, the harness going to this Honda Bridgeline. And that's what I got those connectors from Honda is the uh, uh, the male connector going to the female connector in the Honda and looks identical. And I'm going to try that. I just placed the order. And if it works, uh, I'm going to put everything together. I'm going to show you guys how to do it and how it looks like. I'm going to get a stronger light, uh, one year warranty and cheaper light it's gonna be around 13 to 14 dollars a piece and it's gonna look better the uh, color in these uh power lights honestly ah, i don't know it's it's nice to have it's better than nothing but this uh, you know this kind of yellow color i don't know it's a like a huge contrast between you know the the, the nice uh uh uh, uh uh led lights you got in the front with this battle lights right here i don't know i don't like it too much i want to make a brighter 12k called white and they got a different colors if you guys want to put a blue or any other colors you guys want well i'm gonna do that in my next video just to give you a heads up guys stay tuned and we will see how the other li lights looks like and well unfortunately these battle lights uh, doesn't work very very good in cold weather all right guys stay tuned and see you guys in another just my review stay tuned for the video i'm gonna post it soon very soon see you guys later god bless you all bye bye